course, start with Bill Gates. Bill Gates. Bill Gates. Bill Gates. Mark Zuckerberg. Steve Jobs. Steve Jobs. Steve Jobs. Steve Jobs. Could it be, um, At almost every college, women make up the majority of students. As I started teaching, I noticed and observed that there were not as many women in the program as men. Consistently, we did not have as many female students. If you look in STEM programs, traditionally the female enrollment has been about 10 to 12 percent. If you look at teaching, nursing, or cosmetology, they are overwhelmingly female programs. And this is because of the fact that women can picture themselves in those roles. When we had our first grant, we were really talking, what could we do for our marketing? And we had attended a few workshops and gotten some information, and we really heard that women needed female role models. And that, as our team was sitting and brainstorming one day, it really was, oh, they can't picture themselves. And so then we really came from that for our entire campaign, which we do posters, bookmarks, display boards, that all have the picture yourself in a technology career. We really, if we want to get more females into careers, we have to provide female role models so that they know that others have gone before them and that these are careers that they can do. If women in technology are not involved in it, then we would never be able to set the standard for other generations to come forward. We didn't grow up having all these women in technology to look up to. Um, so we have to do it. We have to be our own role models. And that's why we've really worked hard on our Picture Yourself campaign to make sure we have pictures of women, that we have women guest speakers, that we have women role models, so that any student can picture themselves in our career. I would encourage other people to think broadly about what they can do. And I think that the doors are wide open uh, and I would actively encourage you to consider technology in your career. So learn it today and be successful tomorrow.